Come on, boys. Kill him. Well, well, well. I've been thinking of taming... Oh. Rude. I've been thinking of taming some hyenodons. And there is a pack of hyenodons down there with... Uh, oh. Stupid horse. Seriously? There's a pack of hyenodons down there with uh, two 168s. I think they're male and female. I gotta just double check, though. Stupid RG, get away. Oh, man. Okay. I really wanted hyenodons because I think I really want to, like, resurrect my hunting pack from back on the old Ragnarok days, if you guys remember. Not sure how many actually will remember, but, yeah, that was some fun times. It really was. Uh, so, here. That alpha right there is the 168, but there's another 168, and I don't know why that one's not also glowing, but are they male and male? They are. Damn it. All right. But there's also level 60, and that's it right there. Um, that means plus two means that there's two more. So I think that there's probably no more hyenodons around that area. That is a decent level saber. Nice. Um, so I'm going to quickly just snipe at that level 60. I got to double check which one it is, though. I think it's this one. Nope. Ooh. Lucky I checked. All right. So it's that one off to the side. All right. There we go. 350 damage. We got to kill it, though. And then we might have to leave render distance. Is that it right there? I think it's the one that's freaking out. Oh, where are you going, buddy? I feel like I'm going to miss if I take the shot. Guys, make sure that you hit the like button if you find yourself enjoying this one. We are, of course, on my Patreon uh, medieval server. I'm having a lot of fun on here. I'm probably playing more than I'm recording, which is bad. And oh, hey, look right here. This is something that I probably should have showed off already. Uh, this is part, by the way, don't worry. I didn't actually change my hair. It's just not growing back. Um, so this uh, saddle is actually just a skin, as you can see. Wait, let me pull it off. There we go. It's just a normal saddle skin. And uh, it's part of the, what is it? Saddles Emporium mod, I do believe. I'll leave a, will there be the link to the, um, to the document down below and all the mods are in there but um it's an awesome mod i went ahead and added it to the server but i disabled all the saddles they also have like cool saddles that i think do specific things like reduce weight and stuff but it didn't really fit the theme of this server so i went ahead and just disabled that stuff and uh yeah now we just have awesome saddle skins and they look amazing this is a like a plate armor one and it looks really cool there's no benefit it just looks amazing uh there's a bunch of other different ones and I think the other creatures that we can tame that we can get these skins for are Megaloceros and Parasur, I do believe. But there's also a couple of different creatures that you can get, part of the mod. Check it out if you want to. I have no clue what I'm going to do down here, by the way, because I need to separate these two. So I might have to kill one of the 168s. You're the alpha, so you're probably better. I'm going to kill that one. I know this may seem like a dumb idea, but if they were male and female, I definitely wouldn't do this. This is the only easy way that I can separate them. So I'm going to do it. Let's see. Uh, now he's running away. Going to have to wait for him to stop freaking out. And then we can go ahead and try to get down there and pet his his master and become its master. <laughs> All right. Is it stopped? I think it's stopped. Okay. Nice. Another clean shot. Um, still freaking out. Also, this one was a little bit bloody a few minutes ago. So it might, it might have actually potentially... Okay, I think it might have been in like a fight against something. I'm not exactly sure. All right, bam, we got it. Sweet. So now we can go down there and actually try to tame that, but we got to wait for that glow to disappear. And we should probably try to kill that saber as well. Let me see, let me see. All righty. All right, so I don't know if you actually need gilling armor, but it can, you know, it's probably not going to hurt to have it. Uh, let's go ahead and just leave you there and put you on passive as well. We gotta start petting this thing. Um, is there an easy way down without taking fall damage? Mm. There we go. <laughs> All right, so the hyenodon's like right down here. Oh, I want that purple drop. Okay, hello, buddy. There we go. So 13%, not actually bad to be honest. We do have six times taming on here. So that's pretty nice. Um, oh, he's freaking out. Oh, crap. I stood up and that freaked him out. Well, there's the saber. Got him. <laughs> oh, man. Where did this little puppy go? We just got to be gentle. We got to not stand up or let him touch us, I think. 
Um, it would be great if I built a pen. Oh, you know what? Oh, does that work? I'm thinking maybe if I had enough stuff to make a tent, I might be able to place a tent over him. That could be a thing, but I don't know if I'd be able to find silk around here. Oh, what are you freaking out for, buddy? No! Why did you get angry? What? I didn't do anything wrong. Okay, let's just let him run. <sighs> yeah, I, I realize why I don't really tame these things. They are frustrating. They really are. Look at that. I, I hardly went close to him at all, and he just freaked out. Okay, so I'm coming back with a tent now. Where exactly was this guy? I think he was just down here. Uh, is that it? Oh, okay, hang on. Here we go. We could just open this up and sit in there with him. <laughs> that could be kind of funny, actually. Can he get through here? I wonder. Can he leave? I don't think he can. <laughs> it's just kind of a weird, like image right here of just a little hyenodon inside of a tent, but all right, uh, let's see. Okay, well, we can just sit in the little tent and, uh, he can freak out all he wants. Freaking out, buddy? You gonna come down? All right, I'm gonna leave and I'll come back. <laughs> all right, we're just gonna maybe park the horse somewhere safer. This isn't really a safe spot. There's a Rex up the hills, so. Now, Rexes are, they're pretty dangerous, but I can still handle them. Like, the good part about this server is that we still have weapons, so. You know, six shots on the revolver does like 900 damage, which is pretty good, so. Oh, he's biting my tent. You bastard, no, stop. Oh my God, you, he just broke my tent. That was my only tent. All right, one more pet, and then it's gonna be done. God, I hate passive tames so much. I'd much rather just knock you out and feed you a bunch of stuff for like a half an hour. This is just too involved. <laughs> All right, let's see. I mean, it's cool. It's nice actually having a, a team like this though. It doesn't really cost you anything. Awesome. All right, so do, I think we lost like a level or two there. Um, I would calculate it right now, but I'm not gonna bother. Uh, let's see. Oh, that melee's pretty good, actually. Yeah, that's pretty good right there. 357's nice. Stamina doesn't matter because you can't ride on them. Um, weight is pretty good, too. And then here is the health. So I'm just going to go ahead and take a picture of that right there. Because I can then use that to figure out what the good stats are. So let's go ahead and pet them. So we're going to bring them back to base and uh, then try to find a high-level female and then maybe do some breeding. But... I can't say that we would have like a huge amount of uh, puppies by the end of this one. So we might end up having to take out the baby and the two parents or something. We'll see. So I just ran into a bunch of hyenodons. I only caught the level of the alpha. It's a 174 female, which is nice. Uh, we got a 108, a level 30, a uh, level 60. All right. Well, while they're fighting the RG because they stopped chasing me, we could probably start shooting at them. So let's see. Oh, now they're running at me. Oh my god. Okay, hang on. <laughs> Dude, like one shot and then they're immediately onto me. That is not fair. Okay. Ah, got that one. All right, let's see. Can we... What are they doing right now? Wait, what? Okay, hang on. Let's just stand here then. Just shoot at the others. We can take these hits for sure. Oh, I thought that one was going to start running. Wow, I just murdered the crap out of that one. Oh, okay. Now it's running over here. Got him. <laughs> we might also have to kill that RG. We'll see. Uh, are you... Oh, yeah, that's right. Back away. What are you even doing? Can they even do that? Oh, he is pissed. Dude, you don't even have a pack anymore. Don't like... What is wrong with you? All right. We're probably going to have to kill this RG, so I'll go ahead and do that. And then I guess we're going to try and tame that Hyenodon. It's a level 174 female, so it's kind of perfect. Man, this is awesome. I thought we'd have a hard time finding them here today, but we so far have got a 168 male, and now that 174 female. Definitely in the money here today. Um, All right, let's see. Go ahead and just murder that guy. I should probably go over and grab its corpse because there are shards on it. But I think for the moment, I'll just try to 
maybe tame this thing i might just try and tame it without having to do any traps or anything i did bring a cage and another tent but i don't know if i'll need those i might be able to do it this way the way i did it the last time we'll see what is that over there oh that's an npc dude i should probably kill him first oh okay well carno and these npc people oh that's that ammo okay wait, is he going for the npcs got that one. Oh, oh almost got me i got him with a headshot though which is nice there's another one over there is that carno dead all right is our horse safe i really don't know this area is kind of dangerous Maybe I'll try and put them into the tent just to see. Yeah, that's right. You eat those people. Bam. 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 Ooh, oh, oh, there we go. Sweet. All right. We got it. Nice. Let's check out these stats. Um, Worst weight. Oh, where is it going? Okay. Let's see. So better health, Uh, worst weight, and worst melee. But that's okay. I can definitely I can use this one it's gonna be fine um it wasn't a perfect team if it had been it would have actually come out as a 260 I guess that's like a slightly less than perfect team but still um so that's okay I mean it is what it is but I guess you just lose the levels by just the tiny little increments of seconds that you may not be able to feed it in or not feed it pet it in um so yeah, that's awesome. Anyway, we got two of them. Oh, hello, little NPC hut. I didn't even notice this up here. Uh, well, I mean, the NPCs are dead because those were clearly the ones that we killed earlier. Um, sweet. Lots of awesome stuff there. Two boxes? No. Sometimes the second one spawns, which is kind of funny. Let's see, how much damage does he do to this? Go ahead and bite it there, buddy. Can you? I don't think he can. All right, I'll just kick it. For some reason, the horse just does insane damage, which is kind of hilarious at the same time. Anyway, um, I guess we're going to bring them back to base, or this one back to base, and then we might go ahead and breed the uh, two hyenodons together and just see what we can get. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a little bit. So it's been a few days since that last clip, and now we have a couple hyenodons raised up and everything. I can show you guys now in a second. But before we do that, I wanted to go ahead and crafting skill a bunch of saddles so i have in here enough stuff to craft four of these we actually have a much better blueprint but it's gonna cost 6k hide per so i didn't really want to waste all of that hide on hyenodon saddles so i'm gonna go ahead and craft the much cheaper version i mean it's still pretty expensive but it's much cheaper than the other one plus 58 armor is not too bad either uh, as well as that, we're probably going to go ahead and craft a couple Mastercraft picks. And then I want to craft a pistol and just see if I can get anything better than this one here. So, yeah, let's get going. Um, mind wipe. Bam. All right. So we're going to go straight into crafting skill, but I'm probably going to have to go slow because if you have auto unlock on some Engrams, you can lag the crap out of a server by just leveling up super quick. So, yeah, you got you to gotta keep that in mind. So I'm going to go slow and I'll bring you guys back once we're fully crafting skilled okay so i think from now we can just spam them in but it's still lagging the crap out of me there we go nice so how much do we have we have 870 crafting skill all right cool so we want four of those hopefully oh there's only enough for three i thought i pulled for four okay well this one came out with terrible percentage oh my god three percent that is ridiculous that one's 5%? Are you kidding? Oh my god, those are terrible. Alright, can we craft one more? We can. Alright, I don't know what happened there. Maybe somebody pulled some of the materials. Dude, we got like the worst look of these. Wow, really? Okay. <laughs> Let's craft uh, like five Mastercraft picks because I'm probably not going to use all these, but other people could probably make use of them. All right, so this one here is probably the best. Uh, let's see, so 9%, 8.5, 15, 33, pretty good. So I'm gonna take that one as my main uh, new pick. I'm gonna chuck this one back in here. Let's just craft a couple more, cause like they're pretty cheap and uh, we don't always have this much crafting skill. Um, is there anything better now? I don't, oh yeah, this one is slightly better. You know what, I actually have two picks, so maybe I'll keep those two. 
and then the rest of these picks can be for anybody else who wants one so we want one pistol hopefully we get really lucky on this though oh uh, we didn't all right i'm gonna make one more okay that was terrible we got 0.5 percent wow okay so that was kind of a waste almost i don't even think that was worth the effort i mean this is pretty good but yeah not great not great at all um okay well uh i don't really have anything else to craft so i'm gonna actually mind wipe again and reset my stats to what they were before okay yeah <laughs> i guess i lagged it out for some people there oh man yeah that's really annoying i hate how that actually happens and it could lag out the full server and everything it's super annoying all righty so i'm gonna do that take one of those and um yeah let me just chuck away some of this crap here all right so oh crap i hit the drawbridge oops did not mean to do that Sometimes when you go up to this thing, it just opens up the drawbridge instead, or I guess closes it. Alrighty, well, here are my hyenodons over here. Um, we're pretty low on health because obviously we mine wiped and I have extra health on top of the 100. Um, let's see, so these ones here are the original two. Uh, this is one of the babies. Um, this one's okay, I might actually not use that. I don't know if I'll use that here today. Because it can breed in a little bit and I might want to do that, so... I think I'll leave you, but I'm definitely going to take out these three right here. So which one's the best? Which one's the highest level? I think it's this one. So you get the best saddle and then you get that one and then you get that one. Um, alrighty. So let's take a little look at the stats here. So some of these guys didn't actually come out with the best stats, which sucks. Um, but let's see, let's go ahead and level some into health. Unfortunately, I don't actually get to see what the exact stat is because it takes so long to like appear. Let's see. Come on. Maybe one more after this will get me up to like 2k. All right, perfect. And then the rest can go into melee. Sweet. All right, so we're going to go like three. How much does that go up by? Okay, that should get me up to the full amount, up to about 2k. All right, let's see. Yeah, we're past 2k, sweet. We're gonna go into melee and then melee. Sweet, this one here actually has some really good stats. Perfect, all righty. Well, we're gonna take these things out for a little hunt. Um, We don't have names for them yet and these probably won't be the final Hyenodons, so we'll probably won't name them, but uh. Leave some cool Hyenodon name suggestions down below because I definitely would like to see some. Um, let's quickly head over here. Maybe we can find some stuff to hunt. Come on, guys. They're a little bit slower than my horse, unfortunately, but they're not extremely slow. My horse is imprinted, but I didn't pump any speed. It's just... Yeah. <laughs> the little doggies, they've got tiny little legs. They can't keep up. What happened over here? Who is this? Viking Fred. What? It looks as if somebody's building like a little base out front of our base. Interesting. Huh. Well, I don't know what this is all about, but yeah, this looks to be like it was a base before, maybe. Stuff's about to despawn. Is there anything useful? I'll take that. You know what? We'll take the meat as well. We'll give that to our puppies. So we can, of course, go ahead and pet them, and that's going to give them a little bit of a boost, which is nice. But um, that would involve getting off of the horse constantly and petting them. So I don't know. I can't remember how long that uh, little boost lasts for, to be honest. I don't know. Does that make them faster as well? I don't think it does. Let's see. Is there anything over here to hunt? Because there's usually rexes and stuff down in the grassy area. Maybe we should head down to there, actually. I was thinking of heading off maybe to the beaver, the beaver area, but uh, I don't... Feel like they'd be able to take on a bunch of beavers like that they might die and that would be bad i don't want that let's see so yeah we should probably head down to the grassy field we could probably just take out every single creature that's down there to be honest because i ended on they're pretty vicious and they're also quite good so uh let's see where's the best way to get down i think our little gateway is over here it's really nice uh getting to like just play on the ground like i've only actually used a lamantria once or twice um, I don't even have my own one, but I've been using, like, the one Lymantria that we have left because the other ones died uh, to just get drops and stuff. Um, but 
all in all, like, I'm mostly just running around on a horse, and it's super fun. Honestly, I love this type of gameplay. Like, flyers in Ark are really fun, but I feel like they, they really just limit the gameplay because once you get flyers, you don't really want to run around on a horse, right? But running around on horses is really fun. Um, I don't know. I just really love this type of gameplay. I'm really happy with this server, and I'm also really happy that the, that you guys are really enjoying the videos and everything. Uh, everybody on the server seems to be really enjoying it as well, so definitely think that we created something awesome here. But uh, let's go ahead and start whistling these guys onto some creatures. So there is a raptor with that thingy there. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm up a little bit, so it's a little brighter. Where's my other? Oh, there he is. It's getting stuck. Oh, wow. They do a lot of damage. All right, let's kill the stego. It could also be um, pet as well, and that's going to give them the boost. Maybe we should do that really quick. Let's get a pet in and then see what we can do in terms of damage. Oh, I just got hit by that Diplo. See what we could do in terms of damage, maybe to some Brontos or something. Let's try it on the Diplo first. Go after that Diplo. Okay, what type of damage am I doing? Okay, yeah, that's, oh yeah, 360. That one there is obviously like the little alpha dude. That's obviously the one that has the most uh, health or the most melee. I just spotted that Bronto egg. I really want that. Kibble's difficult on here. It really is. You can't tame the creatures that give that type of kibble. So we definitely want to steal that egg. Um, we can probably take down some of these larger creatures by setting them on fire as well. Always a good idea. Come on, boys. Get in there and kill this thing. Come on. I'll help you take out the Bronto. Go after the Brontos. Alrighty. We gotta watch out for their health, though, because I don't want them to die. That would suck. Alright, that guy's almost dead. I'll let them kill him. Nice. Eat him up. We gotta replenish our little hide situation. <laughs> I mean, we use, like, 8k hide, so... Uh, oh, there we go. Nice. I guess I probably could have just crafted the better saddle. Like, one of them instead of, like, four, obviously. Um, I guess I probably should it on that instead of crafting four of the lesser ones. But I don't know. I thought that was a good idea. Nice. They got him. We'll go after this one next. Yeah, this type of gameplay is awesome. Just, like, hunting packs, ground creatures, horses, guns. Like, ugh, I love it. Come on, boys. Kill him. Here you go. All right, he's gonna be dead in a second here. Sweet. What level's this Dodic? We might kill it. Let's go ahead and kill the Dodic. I just gotta keep an eye out for little bags on the ground though. I think I saw one around here a minute ago. I wanna just check them because I don't wanna leave any shards behind. Because we should have that NPC trader in very soon. Oh, that was rude. Um, and once he's in, I, I wanna obviously be getting just a crap ton of uh, the items and everything. We're gonna have some exclusive items inside of the NPC trader. Stuff that, you know, really isn't medieval in any way, but just quality of life type stuff. Um, there's a dead raptor. Let's go ahead and eat him. There you go, boys. Um, so that's gonna be really nice. We're, we're probably gonna have a, the motorboat in there and uh, a couple other things like that. Just, you know, quality of life because people have been using rafts quite a lot and like rafts are kind of slow. So quality of life stuff like that is definitely needed um let's see where's the other hyena on oh there he is uh let's just take his shards and his sauropod vertebrae and also that's going to be how things are going to be done soon um you're going to be able to trade in those apex items for the shards instead of the creatures actually dropping them uh which i think is a little bit more involved and probably more fun all right come on boys go in and kill that stego you guys don't need any help with that oh my god look at that <laughs> nice alrighty uh there's also a bronto there's a couple more brontos we could probably just kill all of these guys um how much hide did we get so far we got like 400 so not a huge amount i don't know if they're great at gathering in the hide they're probably best at gathering uh meat but it's a little bit handier so i don't have to hop off my horse every single time come on boys get in there let's go ahead and set him on fire we'll set you on fire as well any what is that okay i thought that was an egg for a second i don't know why 
<laughs> uh, we got a dead raptor to eat. All right, come on, boys. Kill him. Eat him up. He's almost dead. Any second now? There we go. Nice. All right. Just making sure there's no bag. Yeah, I think they harvested it. They took his stuff. Uh, let's go ahead and whistle them onto this dude here. I'll just help him out because Diplos are kind of super annoying to kill for small creatures. To get knocked back really, really far. Oh man, look at this. I can't wait to have just a giant pack of high end dons now. That's gonna be the goal. Like, just a giant pack, and I'll be able to bring them out and kill things, but also people. If there's. If we're, you know, <laughs> if we're getting sieged, I could go ahead and just bring my, my army of hyena dons out and just eat all of those people's uh, creatures that they're attacking with. So many stegos around here as well. Pity stegos don't drop anything. I might figure out how to get them to drop stuff. That would be great. Uh, we got a Fiomia they could probably kill. Although I think Fiomia might be able to run quicker than them. And if they, if that is the truth, then uh, Fiomia is probably not something I want them to attack. Come on, get in there. Sweet. All right, well, let's see if they can catch him. We can always maybe shoot him a little. Oh, no, they can catch him. Oh, can they? Yeah, they got him. Nice. I'll help out with this one. Eat him up. Nice. Let's eat up this raptor. Look at this. Me and my little hunting pack. How much uh, damage do you guys take? Wow, none at all, really. I think that they actually rapidly regen from eating bodies. Like, not the meat. I think they... I feel like they get rapid regen from eating bodies specifically, but I might be wrong on that one. I might have to look into their uh, page on the wiki and just read about them again. It's hard to like remember every single thing about every single creature in this game because there's just so many. It's like over a hundred creatures in this game. Come on. You guys going in? Maybe attack what I whistled you on? No. Come on, boys. There you go. Okay. Sweet. They should have him down here in a second. I probably could have pet them again, but I don't really see the point. They're going to kill him. Maybe we'll pet them to kill those two Brontos over there. You guys get pets. Nice. All right, let's get in here and kill these things. Boom. Come on, boys. We going? Come on. In and kill that Bronto, please. What are you doing? Go in and kill him. Okay. I guess I'll run in first. <laughs> I don't know what was happening right there. Yeah, they do so much damage. Look at that. That is a really nice amount. These, these aren't even like the best stats out of my hyena dons as well. I think that's the best part. Okay. We got a raptor in there. Oh, I killed him. Go ahead and eat that Bronto as well, please. And then let's go kill this one. Oh, wow. He's already super bloody. Here you go. How long does that boost last for, actually? Oh, wow. One shot. <laughs> All right. We got a Diplo here. Let's kill him, too. Might as well. All right. Just wait for him to burn out, and then hopefully they don't fall down the cliff. We got one more Bronto. Get in there. Here you go. All right, let's go for him. You guys able to get back up? Yeah, you are. Go on in. Okay. 
We'll kill this thing, and then I think we might head back to base because this is, uh, yeah, this has been pretty good. Not gonna lie, I'm super happy with this. This is gonna be amazing for when there's, like, alpha creatures for us to kill because I could just bring them out and have them all just attack them. There was an alpha rex here the other day, but we killed that. I didn't get any footage of it. I didn't really think it was that entertaining, to be honest. Come on. There you go. Nice. All right, let's see what we got. Let's see all the goodies. I'll take those and the prime. 15 shards, nice. And those. And then you, you've got 20 shards. Nice. All righty, and we got two levels on you. And then you have three. Sweet. And then you have none. You really uh, let us down here, buddy. All right, let's see. So in total, I've gathered 60 shards really quickly. Um... And then technically I gathered more than that because I can always go ahead and trade these in when the trader comes in and they're going to be worth a good amount too. So yeah, that's going to be amazing. Oh man, I can't wait for that thing to be ready. Alrighty, let's go ahead and kill this packy while we're heading back. Guys, I think that's probably going to be it for today. Um, if you have enjoyed the video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you want to see more like this, you can, of course, subscribe. And again, you can join the server. Uh, there's a link to the patron and everything down below if you are interested. And uh, if not, that's also fine because there's going to be tons of videos on here. I hopefully can get a nice long video series out of this here. Um, I'm having a lot of fun though, seriously. So hopefully I could get more recording done than just playing because I've been doing way more playing. Anyway, I'll catch you in the next one.